friends. I'm so glad that you're with me again to learn about a new letter and some of the amazing things that God has created. I have Hedgie here and she's ready to read our new words. Are you ready? She said, it's a good day. And we know it's a good day because God created you and me to share his glory. And we're going to be bringing up a new letter. Are you ready to see what it is? Our new letter is the letter I. I is a long stick with a little stick on the top and the little stick on the bottom. You will know a little I because a little I is just a little stick with a little dot right on the tippy top. I can say its name, I, or we can say it. Look what I have here. I have an ice cream and I have a lizard. This kind of lizard's called an iguana, an iguana. Are you ready to see what words I have that start with I? Hedgie's ready, let's see. I have some icicles. Icicles are great I words. We get those when it's cold. And I have a visitor here who wants to help me. Here's Tassie. Let's see what Tassie wants to show us. Oh, what's this, Tassie? An igloo. Is that an igloo? It is an igloo. An igloo is made out of ice or ice house. Oh, what's this, Tassie? Oh, she doesn't look that. That's an insect. Oh, an insect. Sometimes we might call them bugs, but an insect is a little different from a bug. It's a part of a bug family, but it has six legs and three body parts. An insect. I'll put it over here by our iguana. You ready, Tassie? What's this? Ice. Ice is great for putting in your drinks to make it cold. Oh, help me out there, Tassie. Great job. And there's one more thing that I wanted to show you. Are you ready, Tassie? <gasps> What's this? It's true. It's ice cream and it's good for licking, right? Oh, <gasps> do you see how Tassie was licking me? I'm not an ice cream cone, Tassie. Well, our story today is about ice cream. What do you think of that, Tassie? The ice cream so good. Well, I'm going to have Tassie be back in. Well, actually, no, Tassie, do you want to help me out with our next thing? Yes. So I'm going to move our eye over this way. And I'm going to be bringing out some ice cream cones. Just pretend ones that I've made. And let's see what, how many I'm going to have. Are you ready? One, two, three ice cream cones. And we're gonna have different flavors. We're going to have, here is my ice cream container. We're gonna have chocolate. What's right here, Tessie? Strawberry and vanilla. And we're going to see which scoop is going to get the most. I have an ice cream scooper and when I press it and it stops, it'll show me what color ice cream I need to scoop. There's brown, and there's white for vanilla, and there's even pink. Oh, where's that pink? Oh my goodness, it's coming. But there's a pink here too for strawberry too. Let's see which one we do, we have the most of. Are you ready? You ready, ready Tessie? Oh, vanilla is my first scoop of vanilla ice cream. Let's see what my next one will be. Oh, chocolate. One for chocolate, one for vanilla, but none for strawberry. Oh, a strawberry. Now they're all equal. One, one, and one. Strawberry, do you see the pink? Two for strawberry. Chocolate, two, one, two chocolates and one, two strawberries. A vanilla, my friends, do you notice that they're all equal? I'm going to do it two more times. Now let's guess to think which one's going to have the most. 
Will it be the chocolate, the strawberry, or the vanilla? Hmm, this is making Tassie very hungry. <gasps> One for strawberry! Let's count them. One, two, three! <gasps> One more, my friends. What's it gonna be? Press it and... <gasps> it's chocolate! <gasps> oh no, friends! I thought that we would have one half the most, but do you notice we have one, two, three chocolate, and one, two, three strawberry, and one, two vanilla. Do you think we can get one more? We're gonna do one more. Let's see if we could break that tie. Oh, here we go. Vanilla! Oh my goodness. My friends, do you know what I think is gonna happen? I think we're supposed to have the same number, and that's pretty neat. One, two, three, one, two, three, and one, two, three. The good thing about ice cream is that it's a wonderful treat to have, especially on warm days. And sometimes they even have special ice creams for doggies too. I know at Rita's they have something called pup cups. <laughs> and Tassie really likes those with her puppy brother Kirby. Right, Tassie? Well, I'm going to put Tassie down. Say bye, Tassie. And we're going to read a story about ice cream. The story's called, Should I Share My Ice Cream? And there's the letter I for I, like I love you. And there's I for ice cream. And this is my friend Gerald. And Gerald is not sure if he should share his ice cream with his best friend, Piggy. Let's get our two ears to listen and our two eyes to look. Let's keep our lips so quiet so we can read this ice cream book. Oh, look at all that ice cream, my friends. Yummy. Should I share my ice cream? Ice cream, get your cold ice cream for a hot day. Oh boy, ice cream. I like that the penguin is selling ice cream. One ice cream, please. Here you go. Mmm, I wonder what kind that is. Mm. Oh boy, oh boy, I love ice cream. Look how happy he is. Wait, Piggy loves ice cream too. Piggy is my best friend. Should I share my ice cream with her? Do you share with your best friend? Let's see what Gerald's going to decide to do. Oh, should I share my awesome, yummy, sweet, super great, tasty, nice, cold ice cream? Oh, he really loves this ice cream. Mmm. Mmm. Uh, maybe Piggy doesn't like this flavor. Sharing a flavor Piggy does not like would be wrong. So I will eat my ice cream. Uh, well, wait. Piggy will like this flavor. It is a very yummy flavor. Oh, maybe she does like it. I will share my ice cream. It will not be easy. Hey, Piggy is not here. She does not know I have ice cream. I will eat ice cream. Where is Piggy? What if I said, what if she is sad somewhere? I must find her. Oh, look what's happening to the ice cream friends. And I will say, would you like some of my ice cream? And then she would say, thank you. That would cheer me up. Oh, look. Then I will give her some ice cream to share. Yum. Look, he's imagining how happy she would be. Then my best friend will be happy. Oh, look how happy they are together. 
I will do it. I will share my plop ice cream. <gasps> what happened to the ice cream? Gerald waited too long and it melted and it fell off. Oh no. <gasps> no. <laughs> Mrs. Smith is a good actress. <gasps> now, Piggy can't have any of my ice cream. Now I can't have any of my ice cream either. Nobody's going to have ice cream. I blew it. That means he thinks he ruined it. Nobody's getting ice cream. Do, 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 do. <gasps> Who's coming? Hmm? You look sad. Would you like some of my ice cream? Thank you. That would cheer me up. Look, Piggy has ice cream. And she's right away sharing it. Yum. Mm. Look how happy they are, friends. <gasps> that was not my plan. He wanted to be the sharer. Oh, well. <laughs> This works too. Look at that. They decided that sharing is a great way to be. <gasps> Pop those hands up. The end. Well, my friends, I gl I'm so glad that we were able to read some stories about ice cream and that Tassie was able to join us for some fun too, my friends. There are going to be some wonderful and exciting exciting things that we're going to get to do with ice cream. So you look below and you can maybe even read some stories. Ah, here she is. Here's our Tassie. Well, Tassie wants you to know that God made you special and he loves you so much. So see you real soon for the next time we talk about I4 insects. Ooh. Oh, she's not so sure how she feels about that. <laughs> we'll see you real soon. Bye-bye.